If you build a box in the pit lane and you're just driving like that, parallel, do everything else. Yeah. Well, the new car, every year you get excited, you know, for a new car. It's, uh, I think it provides a, or presents a new opportunity. I think firstly the, the livery, I think the car looks great. And from a feeling, it was just nice to get a few laps again um, after a, you know, a Christmas break. It's hard to know yet where we'll be, of course, it's only early, but um, for me personally, I felt really good getting uh, behind the wheel again. So being back with Red Bull was already, um, yeah, something that felt quite, made me feel whole again, uh, you know, being back with that family and, you know, for, the team now this year, Visa Cash Up RB, it's, you know, it's another, it's another phase of this team's career. You know, it's, 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 a, it's a time where I feel that, yes, we have some amazing partners on board who are gonna help us get closer to the front of the grid. But I, I, I feel like it's a time where it's, we're no longer seen as just a Red Bull kind of junior team. It's, it's, a, it's a team that's standing on their own two feet. And I think, yeah, for other teams to take us seriously, this is the, the chapter I feel we are about to start. Preseason testing is really important for us. As, as a driver, yes, to get, to get, let's say, your eye and your feel back in. Also to, to get your fitness up behind the wheel. But as a team, it's the, it's the moment where we all need to be more than a team than ever. You know, because once the races start, it, it, you, you quickly run out of time. And, and the testing is a chance for us to really set the tone and be clear on the direction where we need to take the team because there's always going to be ways to improve and areas to, to find lap time. Yeah, feeling, feeling great in the, on the truck. Um, yeah, first run with the Carve 01. Um, went all smooth. Um, already failed a couple of steps uh, improvement compared to last year and a like really big step I felt compared to same time as last year. Um, so yeah, that was good uh, and super enjoyed with uh, also a new car, um, with the new livery, uh, new team, you know. Um, yeah, so overall it was a positive day. I would say overall easier handling car. Um, and yeah, I just didn't feel any outstanding issue or outstanding like strong characteristic uh, movement. So, um, so far I'm feeling positive. Every year is um, always looking forward to, for my home Grand Prix. Um, other than that, yeah, still I'm looking forward to general races. Um, I, li I like Japan and also probably, yeah, Texas. I really like Texas, um, the city itself and yeah, I think those two are my main um, two tracks I'm looking forward to. And hopefully, you know, one of the track, either Italy or Monza, you know, for our home Grand Prix. 
uh, it will be great if I if he can score good points or even podium. It's it's very special uh, moment because obviously uh, many incredible memories uh, with his teams uh, more than ten years ago. Incredible feelings to uh, to be back here to find uh, to be able, to be lucky enough to work again with uh, the very many talents uh, of Faenza and of Pista. So we have um, a very unique um, setup for uh, the management team uh, here at uh, Visa Cash App uh, RB. Uh, Peter and I are operating uh, hand in hand as a duo leaderships. Um, each of us has his own area of responsibility. Peter is looking after all the uh, business sides of the company, the, the commercial, the marketing, the communications. And I'm looking after the uh, sporting side, the technical side and the production side of the, uh, of the, of the team. We have uh, seen the birth of a new Formula One team, Visa Cash App RB, uh, which is not only the evolution of a Formula One team, it is, uh, uh, it is really a new team fighting for its place on the grid. We had a super exciting launch event in Las Vegas, which uh, was setting the tone for the year with uh, combining music, sports, arts, entertainment. And, uh, and so we are really looking forward to, uh, to hitting the track soon. Visa Cash App RB will be providing a new experience to fans. We want to make sure that, um, first of all, we will aim at democratizing the sport. Through our partnerships with, uh, with Visa and Cash App, we will uh, uh, create a lot of events around the Formula One uh, um, races over the weekends. There will be music uh, um, events happening. There will be all sorts of you know, actions and, and attra attractions being provided for the fans. So we want to make sure that the fans can engage with the team, the fans can engage with the drivers, the fans can engage with other fans and make sure that you know, they, they, uh, they jointly have an amazing experience. At the same time, we believe and also our partners and shareholders believe that, that there are two universal languages, uh, which, are, which is sport and music. Everybody understands a beat, everybody understands a race or a sporting result and bringing those two together, sport and entertainment, is another element that we want to add uh, um, to the Formula One calendar. I mean, the, the overall goal is, you know, we, we want to be competitive, we want to be fighting hard in the midfield um, and, and really able to extract all the performance that the car has available and then we develop it from that point. So, uh, you know, I think if we can tick all of those boxes and get the best out of the car, we'll be happy. And then a clear direction to develop it. So there are objectives for the year starting from the first race. You know, for Formula One's very competitive at the moment, it's very close. Uh, we had a strong finish to the year last year. Um, our expectation is that we're in that fight in the midfield and, and we can get into that fight a little bit earlier, be a bit more consistent and, uh, you know, be a, a feature in all of the races, really battling hard in the fight for points and uh, trying to extract the most from the car and from ourselves.